Hello and welcome back to Delicious Nook. I'm Ka. Today I will be making another easy holiday appetizer. I will be making some crock pot meatballs. This is a recipe that one of my good friends had shared with me a long time ago and it's very simple and easy. So if you're interested, please stay tuned and let's get started. Here are the ingredients you will need. To get started, cut open the package of meatballs and pour the meatballs onto a baking sheet and spread the meatballs in a single layer on the baking sheet. Bake the meatballs in the oven at 400 degrees Fahrenheit until the meatball has browned a bit. In the meantime, in a medium sized saucepan, Pour in the grape jelly and pour in the ketchup. Simmer the ketchup and grape jelly on low heat until the grape jelly dissolves and the sauce becomes a smooth consistency. Once the sauce starts to boil, make sure you stir occasionally to prevent the sauce from burning. Continue to stir the sauce until you get that smooth consistency. Remove the sauce from the heat and set to the side to cool. Once you remove the meatballs from the oven, pour the meatballs into a crock pot or slow cooker. Now pour in the sauce mixture into the crock pot. Stir and mix the meatballs and sauce until well combined. Once it's well mixed, cover with the lid. Set the slow cooker at low for about 3 to 4 hours, depending on how hot your slow cooker gets. Make sure to stir the meatballs around each hour to an hour and a half to rotate the meatballs. Put the lid back on and let it continue to cook. After 3 to 4 hours your meatballs are done and it's ready to be served. This appetizer is so easy and simple, anyone can make it. You can definitely serve this on a platter with some appetizer picks or leave it in the slow cooker for your guests to serve themselves. This appetizer is not only a big hit with the adults, it's also a hit with the little ones. They love it. I hope you give this recipe a try, and if you do, please comment down below. I will leave a written recipe down in the description box below. I want to wish everyone a happy holiday and thank you for watching. And if you like this video, please like, share and subscribe and I'll see you next time. Bye!